What's up, YouTube? It is February the 21st, 2015. And I'm going to come at y'all with a very special review, in my opinion, because I would call this, I guess, the ugly duckling of the Jordan so far this year. It didn't get much hype. You know, you got a lot of people, you know, saying, I don't really like them. You got mixed emotions. And everywhere I go, I can find my size. And the size 10 is a very, very common size. So with that being said, let's get straight into the review. Um, first of all, I'm going to show y'all this receipt, Foot Action. And by the way, y'all need to join Foot Action and Star Club if you got a local Foot Action that's pumping the shoes out because when you buy shoes, uh, 100 and over, they give you like $10, $20 coupons. So, and you're able to use them on Jordans. You can't lose, use them on Quick Strikes, but Jordans, I'll be tearing their heads up. I just got these joints today with $20 off messing with it. So, yeah, straighten the shoe. By the way, I got them uh, Barons on. You know what I'm saying? Going through the Barons, trying to be fly today. You know what I'm saying? And today we're going to be showcasing that Jordan Retro 4 in the Oreo colorway box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Size 10. Box not bad looking at all. Shoes got this trash bag looking material. Voila! Jordan Retro 4 in the Oreo colorway. I like this shoe, man. I know y'all got mixed emotions, but this joint nice, man. Two, three years, y'all gonna be able to really appreciate this shoe. It's only being remastered one time and retro one time. It actually came out in 1999 originally. We'll start with the bottom of the shoe very basic. We have a jump man sign, um, bottom sole black. And you've got your uh like your flint gray. We'll take it to the um midsole of the shoe. We got an air unit on the back. We'll take it to size classic four. It's not really too much to say about it. I mean, it's a all black shoe. It's um you got your jump man sign on the back, tongues made out of like um leather, it's all tumble leather. This leather is soft as fuck, and no, it's not flimsy. It's real nice, man. Check the tongue of the shoe, the Jordan, you know. And if you look at the um hands and the shoes, they're really defined on the Jordans. You can tell a lot of the time, like from those are knockoffs, but we don't do knockoffs over here, as y'all can tell. Then you got the um waffle laces, which are um flint gray and speckled in black. You know what I'm saying? I am really, really liking the shoe, y'all. Um, it's basic, but it's 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 a it's a nice basic shoe. I mean, show you the other one. It actually came with this Jordan thing on the uh, lace. So. Real nice shoe, y'all. Um, they shouldn't be hard to get at all. Y'all can go to y'all local stores. I'm pretty sure and pull your size. So if y'all looking to get a man, they're not hard to get. Um. Again, man, like, subscribe, comment, solo run the game. You can check me out on Instagram. You can check me on Twitter, Facebook, whatever. Y'all leave me y'all uh, y'all thoughts. Y'all can personally inbox me. And um, the first 500 subscribers, I'll be giving out a pair of shoes, man. Um, so hell, y'all fuck with it. And um, yeah, you know what I'm saying. Solo run the game. I'll be back at y'all with the Marvin the Martian sevens next go round. Um, we do this, baby. So go ahead, hit that subscribe, man. Hit that like button, man. Fuck with your boy. I holler at y'all. One.